Hi Shannon, uh, sorry this took so long to get to you, but I wanted to show you how to uh, burn that wedding DVD that I had for you guys to a DVD. Um, so hopefully you still have this little file that looks kind of like this. It should be somewhere in your computer. Um, I'm going to show you how to burn that onto a disc so that you could play it on a TV. Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do is click somewhere on your desktop so that it says Finder right here. And then we're going to go to Go. So click on that and then go down to, uh, let's see here, Utilities. So we're going to click on Utilities and then go to Disk Utility, which is this one right here. Uh, so then we're going to open that up by double-clicking on it. Okay, so we get this little list here. Uh, so what we're going to have to do is go up to File and Open Disk Image. So this is going to bring up a little window that's going to ask us where the disk image is stored. Now, I have it on my desktop, so you can see that it's right here. Uh, however, yours might be in your Movies folder or in your Documents folder or somewhere else, so hopefully you know where it is. Um, either way, though, so you're going to end up uh, clicking on this and then clicking Open. Alright, so we'll click Open, and it says that it's attaching image Shannon and Jeremy right there. Alright, so now you see in this window right here that it has uh, shown up kind of towards the bottom of this list. Now, when we do this, you're going to want to click on, let's see here, you're going to want to click on this one, the, the top one that looks like a little piece of paper, kind of. So we'll click on that one time, and then you can go up to Burn right here. So we'll click that, and now you just would put in a CD, or a DVD, sorry, put in a DVD and then it will uh, burn it to the disc. It'll take um, a couple minutes so just kind of let it run and then once it's done you can take it out of your computer and play it on a TV. Okay so hope everything's going well. I will see you later.